Bill Gowdy checking in. Out here on the Mississippi River, catching a few uh, catfish and having a good time. Yeah, it's uh, I tell you, uh, winds out of the north do not go forth, but uh, it's cooling down nicely. I think the high today is going to be 83, but it's overcast. You can uh, just see. I don't know if you can see that or not. That uh, it's a cloudy sky and the sun is just trying to peek through. But uh, the fish are biting moderately, and uh, probably because the wind's out of the north. Uh, let me see if you can see. Can you see that? Can you see those pelicans up there? That's just beautiful. It's just beautiful. Anyway, I got a few catfish in the boat, uh, a couple small ones, and one nice, I don't know, probably three pounder in there. We're going to have a shore launch. I uh, maybe you guys want to join me. Check it out. This is uh, where I come for shore lunch sometimes. And sometimes I camp here. You're not supposed to. It's uh, within the no camping area, but nobody can get here but by river. So I guess if conservation wanted to enforce it, they could, but nobody really messes with you down here. You're not, you're not mess with anyone. But uh, it's a nice little spot. Check it out. So I caught a few catfish. I love them small ones. I'm gonna cook up a couple small ones for lunch. Grandpa always used to call those little ones veal. And I'm telling you, they are probably some of the best eaters. I know, but no one complains at my fish fries, but uh, they are good, let me tell you. All right, I'm gonna clean up a couple and get a fire going and uh, we'll cook up some lunch. So while the fire is getting ready, we'll get the fish ready. I made a salad, so I'm gonna have a salad and some fish. Look at this. This is the cast iron skillet I carry in the boat. And uh, I don't know what brand it is. Uh, let's see if you can see that. That handle, we got a number, I think that's a number nine on there. It's hard to make out. It's thinner. Than, uh, than most pans and it has this notch on the bottom it has a ridge around it it's got a little notch on the handle there but uh, it's not marked I don't know what uh, what brand that is but uh, I sure do like it I, I keep it in the boat just for occasions like this so I like to take a knife and score my fish my catfish I just cut those to the bone uh, you know, quarter to three-eighths inch apart. And then I put them in that. What I'm using is a blend of coconut flour and almond meal. Oh, man, is it so good. So good. And I'm going to pan fry them in that cast iron skillet.
like it's about a quarter of an inch. I usually bring a stick of butter and I didn't. I'm roughing it. Bring that temp oil up to temperature. And we'll add the fish. Yeah, oil's starting to make some noise. Let's see if it's uh the other hot tub. Oh yeah. Man, I hope that north wind isn't messing with you guys. I'm telling you, it's a warm, it's it's nice. I think it's 83 degrees today. Uh, it's been overcast and partly cloudy, but uh, wind sh shifted out of the north and uh, I caught a few fish, not not like I have been, just been catching a few. It's time to get your priorities straight. Yeah, I got mine. I'm having a diet Dr. Pepper. Yeah, they're far and few between, but I'm having one. I brought some fresh water and I got wet ones there. Got a package. Got a package in the mail. We gotta do another outdoor video of uh, you know, brats, I guess. <laughs> Scratch. Scratch my ass. Link for him down below. Sent me some mustard. Yeah. Water water burger. There ain't no water burgers around here. I appreciate that, Scratch. I really do. Now I'm gonna make a video for you. Yeah, I just have to decide how to do it. I, I think I'm going to go back to the gun range. I haven't decided yet, but... Ah, oh, fish are looking like they're ready to be turned. Let's get to turning, shall we? Oh, look at that. Say, Joe Gaddy, that's a lot of fish. <laughs> I love fish. I love cooking them just like this. I'm telling you, but that really isn't a lot of fish. That's just enough for me. I didn't have any breakfast this morning in anticipation of this. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna have a salad. I got a salad in the cooler. Yeah, I made it. I'm cheating. I'm gonna have a salad and I'm gonna have some fish. That'll do it for me. I'm uh. I'm counting my carbs and I'll tell you what, it's working. I'm close. And one of these days we're gonna have a bush. Yeah, we are. Take a look. Let's take a look at the goodness. Ah, yeah, it's a lot of salad. Look at this, huh? Catfish. Oh man, let's dig in. Let's dig into that, shall we? I'm so hungry. Man, I hope that wind doesn't bother you guys. Sure not bother me. It's nice to have a cool temperature for a change. Yeah, 83 degrees, cool. Yeah, cool. Oh. I'm telling you, it doesn't get any fresher. Uh, 
I am telling you, it doesn't get any fresher than this. Man, oh man. That is so good. Let's try a bite of this garden fresh salad. I'm telling you, tomatoes, all peppers, all this stuff come right out of the garden. Yeah, the blue cheese didn't. Man. Holy cow. That is so good. Let's wash it down with a Dr. Pepper, shall we? You wash it down in my honor. Yeah. Well, no, 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 any kind of beverage of your choice. It doesn't have to be an adult beverage. Although I like that bush beer, and bush this isn't, but I'm telling you, I'm losing weight, I'm feeling good. I want to uh, catch a few more fish. I want to make a few more videos. I'm, I really appreciate you guys watching, and oh man, that's great. Thanks for all the subscriptions, that is awesome. Bill Gaddy out. <laughs>